Hey YouTube, this is King B Sky here coming at you with another video. Now today, I have for you today is an OP chapter review. So without further ado, let's just get into this video. We have officially begun Volume 3. So this chapter is called The Pirate Buggy the Clown. So we begin our chapter off from where we left off from last time. Kabaji, Zolo, Mochi, and the mayor of this town are all on the floor. They're passed out their cold. Nami went to get her treasure in the middle of Orange Town. Now Luffy and Buggy are having a standoff in this town. So Buggy just mentioned red hair shanks. And of course Luffy being interesting, interested in it wants to know how Buggy knows Shanks, but Buggy points out the obvious, obvious that saying that him and Luffy are mortal enemies. Kind of gets his swords on his fingers. So he has like a mini swords and he has eat one for each fingers. So Luffy grabs his, you know, um, arm and Buggy starts walking towards him. He's like, not even whoever can receive a razor sharp blade. Luffy's like, maybe so. And then Buggy throws a chop chop buzz so choppy like he throws kind of like throws his downside with his arm attached to it and it kind of goes in a circle or a spin of course like Luffy's like let's see you dodge I mean Buggy's like to Lu Buggy says to Luffy let's see you dodge these in mid air and of course Luffy just like like no problem and he just kind of stretches out of the way of Buggy's bus through a couple buildings and he does a gum gum pistol. Buggy dodges it of course. Got Buggy's like, you got interesting powers, but a mine are more freakish. He's like, but your stre but your stretched out arm makes a delicious target. And of course Luffy grabs the side of the window of a building and says, Gum gum. Gum gum sickle. It almost just freaking takes out Buggy's head, but you know, Buggy like Kind of does a chop chop thing with his head and detaches his head from his body. He can do that because he chop chop. So he dodges a bullet from Luffy. Of course, Buggy's laughing. He's like, You've underestimated me, gummy boy. Luffy just kind of passes out in the rubble, but then just gets up again. Luffy's like, Darn, how am I supposed to whack you if you keep flying to pieces? And of course, Luffy's like, Dang it. And of course, Nami's still watching there. She's still there. She still hasn't got the treasure. She's like, She looked, um, the valve. She's like, wow, what an amazing fight. This is Nami saying this. Of course, Buggy's henchmen are supposed to be unconscious. They're trying to play dead, but they're really awake. And then Buggy does a chop-chop harpoon. And it looks like he just stretches out his arm. Luffy grabs it. But he kind of, it kind of slipped. Well, he um, Buggy does a separate, so he cut himself into even more pieces and, like, scratches up partial of Luffy's hat or Shanks' hat. Shanks, you know, of course the hat Shanks gave to Luffy whenever he was a little boy at Fushia Village. And he's like, that does it, you nicked my hat. And he's like, well, so, this is my treasure, no one damaged this hat. Of course, Nami remembering that Luffy did say that her friend did give it to him a very, very long time ago. And he's like, is that hat really important to you? And he's like, that's right. And then Buggy throws another knife at it at Luffy and then he's actually just trying to aim for his hat at this point and then just gets three sort of as many swords he had like this so he carries his swords like this kind of did like a three thing with them and like Luffy's hat got stretched again it started to get banged up then Luffy then remembers Shanks giving him the hat do me a favor keep this hat safe for me so Shanks is border echoing in Luffy's mind now Buggy has the hat he's like yeah you call this beetle thing your treasure then Luffy just charges at him, and he's like, I promise Shanks I'd give that hit, hat back to him someday. What, this is Shanks' hat? I thought it looked familiar. Then Buggy tells Luffy that Shanks and him worked on the same pirate ship a very, very long time ago. And they were both young. Apprentice's pirates, you may say. Luffy's like, Shanks is a great man. Apprentice's pirate together. Chop, chop, quick, this thing. Because, um, Buggy, like, looks like chops off his neck but Luffy kind of just like kicks him into the midsection and of course Buggy just puts on a silly face because it really really hurted and of course Luffy's saying don't put yourself on the same level as him and that is it for this chapter review not a very 
not a, a decently long chapter. Not a really, really long one. So let me know what you thought of this video. If you liked it, hit the like button. Hit the dislike button if you disliked it. Hit the subscribe button for more content like this. And hit that gray bell to be notified when I make a new video. I am signing out.